Hello and welcome to my channel Green Lion Goddess Tarot. This is your daily reading for June the 4th, 2021. So we will see what is coming through. There has been energies around of late. Been a bit of a funky energy actually, possibly for some of you, where you could be feeling a bit sensitive. We have the Page of Swords. We don't forget we are still in Gemini season and that Page of Swords reminds us of that. Get more information, more to learn. Sagittarius, those Gemini Sagittarius themes are coming out still around your well, around balance in your life, and that was kind of a theme yesterday, but now we're looking at it from a kind of more of a holistic view. Yesterday we seemed to be focused in on relationships, balance in relationships and balance to self and health and what is good for you, really looking at boundaries. But let's see what today brings. Today it's like open your mind, see a wider perspective. We're going to look at this from a... Uh, even higher cast the net even further and more of a bird's eye view with the king of swords very clear detached mind is uh, very much on the table the four of wands is coming in which is nice and the knight of swords the other gemini more gemini energy so so we're back in the mind, back in the mind, very much back in action. Uh, it's like, okay, we've had a little break for a moment. We've been in this kind of more grounded, kind of maybe even heavier energy. It is still around with that seven of pentacles at the base. I didn't show you that, but the seven of pentacles is at the base. And But right at the centre, the king of swords, clear mind, a sense of detachment. There may be some decisions that need to be made and need to be made quickly. Uh, around health, around what balance, a holistic view of what is good for you. And it is learning about this. There's a lot of information coming in terms of receiving information, being very detached, making a decision. Boom. The, uh, temperance is around balance, like we said, but it's for what's good for you on a higher level and again that seven of pentacles where do you want to invest your time and energy we're really looking at this from a whole heap of different angles and that energy is coming in quite quite um strongly and this time it's like right now we're throwing all of our intellect at this but don't forget our higher mind as well and so that four of wands energy is really nice because for me, this is a foundation of self, the four of wands. This is very much a sense of what you are creating for who you are and you're building upon that. We've got the, the sense of building blocks, uh, building a, a stronger sense of self, a stronger sense of balance within your life, really a sense of honouring yourself and what it is that you need is what's coming in. But this time it's not emotional. It's not emotional at all. It's very much very rational energy. And so with the Knight of Swords, I do feel like it's just the both the page and the knight are working for that king. That king in the centre is like the major, if you think of Game of Thrones, he's the major player of the day, that king of swords, which is a beautiful Aquarian energy and it is very much looking towards the future. What is it do you need to cut out? What is it that's working for you? How can you make decisions around all of that? And so, again, it's this sense of analysing. It's a sense of... Uh, what's the word? Not reworking, but it, it is like an, an analysis, I guess is probably the word. You are looking at something very closely and saying what what is working, what isn't. So it is a process which my brain can't think of the word. Very tired brain this week, but you know what I mean. It's a process of dissemination almost. But yeah, it's, um, I think... Sometimes when this energy comes in, it also makes you realize that there might be the need for a level head. There might be the need for this sort of stuff. So you might be feeling sometimes when this energy comes in, you can feel the opposite to this. And so uh, and this is where, you know, you might be going, well, I need to have a clear head. I need to bring in the balance. I need to be looking at my relationships and who's good for me and who isn't and how. what's my relationship to myself. Am I actually happy? and what parts of me aren't happy. So it's very much kind of, yeah, looking at things as a whole, looking at the bigger picture of your life, what's working for you and what isn't. So, yeah, that's it, I would say. The King of Swords can also be another person coming through uh, that 
is a decision maker that's coming in very strongly today. But, yeah, he does make decisions, this King of Swords, so it might be there's some decisions pending or decisions are made quickly today, uh, however they, whether they're de- your decisions or someone else's decisions. And I don't feel like they're bad. I feel like they're for the greater good. Um, so, And those decisions are, might very much be around the Seven of Pentacles, which is where to put your time and energy. So that's it for the reading for today. I uh, look forward to seeing you tomorrow and that would be the reading for the weekend. So see you then.